Have you had your inner health bus today? Good morning, everyone. We're at the launch of the AIA Vitality Mini Ruse this morning, which is all about young kids from 4 to 11 getting into the sport of football. And hopefully one day they'll grow up to be legends of the game, just like Tommy Urich, who's joining us here this morning. We're going to talk about his amazing effort in the Asian Cup the other night and that incredible goal. And speak, speaking of the Asian Cup, this is what we worked hard for. That is the Asian Cup. It weighs about 30 kilos. So we've got Tyanese and Jasper down there holding on nice and tight. Hopefully one day they'll be able to walk away with one of them themselves. But let's have a look at the weather quickly, see what's going on around your place. Maybe a good day to get out and have a little bit of a kick yourself with the kids. Sunny in Cairns, 35. 35 and late showers for Townsville. Showers and rain for Brisbane and the Gold Coast, 28. Possible showers in Sydney, 25. And Canberra, mostly sunny, 27 degrees. Becoming mostly sunny in Melbourne, 22. A late shower possible in Hobart today, but sunshine and 29 for Adelaide. Perth, a shower or two and possible storms, 36. Sunny for the Alice, 32 degrees. And Darwin, a shower or two, possible storms and 32 degrees. Tommy Urich, you are the man of the moment. You became a legend in one incredible move on Saturday night. We needed a second goal to win. We've got the footage here. Mate, talk us through what you were thinking when you are on the goal line. You had these, these two guys all over you. What were you trying to achieve? Uh, basically, I was uh, trying to win a foul for, for us and um, you know, give us a chance of, of scoring a goal, but um, obviously it didn't happen. And uh, Something else had to be done, and um, you know, fortunately, somehow I wiggled my way through and um, you know, got the ball into, into a dangerous area, and um, we ended up scoring from it. There was a bit of master work. Did you see James Triosi there waiting for the ball? I didn't see James, but uh, I saw Jason Davidson running in on, on the back post, and um, you know, unfortunately didn't get to him, but uh, it fell into a dangerous area, and, and we scored from it. Now, how did you feel? Yeah, obviously I was uh, overwhelmed after um, you know the whole tournament and, and how much hard work we put into into winning the all those games and um, getting to the final and uh, fortunately it paid off. Yeah, mate. What about this uh, young mini ruse program? Would you have had something like this when you were coming through? Um, when I was younger, uh, I was unfortunate uh, not to have any of these kind of programs. But uh, my father was my my program. Um, <laughs> every day after school, uh, we used to go train together. So um, yeah. Um, How important do you think it is for the kids though, at this age to be to be getting involved? Yeah, it's um, it's vital. Um, you know, it's it's a great program to to have for young kids um, uh, to to learn how how it is to, to live healthy and um, you know enjoy the enjoy the sport and um, you know get along with their friends and. Um, um, you know, it, it gives them uh, good habits for the rest of their lives. Well, mate, I think Australia, thank you at the moment. We, we all think you're responsible for bringing home the Asian Cup, which is down there. The kids are pretty excited about it. So, mate, thank you very much for joining us. And Pleasure. congratulations on the big win. Uh, absolutely incredible effort. And, uh, kids, I reckon we get another game going. What do you reckon? Yeah. yeah. Okay, how about three cheers for Tommy? Hip hip. Hooray! Hip hip. Hooray! Balls up. Hip hip. <laughs> All right, way to go, Carl and Lisa. We shall see you tomorrow morning with more on today. Look at that kid's run off with a trophy. <laughs> hey, I mean, I mean, they did it to go. me. Hey, Mum, look what you got. Heavy for me. Good on you. Well done, Tommy. Well done, Stevie. Well done to all of those parents who get up early and stay up late and take their kids off to school sport or whatever their passion is. Well, coming up, the disease of...